Oh, what's up, Libra? <laughs> Welcome to BMHP's Table Etiquette. We're um, we're gonna break down the energy today for you and your person. We're gonna put your person over here, put you over here, use two decks and kind of see where the energy is. You know, I'm coming out of that Virgo energy, so you guys gotta excuse me. But um, let's go ahead and get into your message. You guys, don't forget to check out BlackMadonnaHP.com. That's my clothing website for the grown and sexy. So you want to make sure you check that out, okay? Either way, let's go ahead and get into this message. Beloved, what's going on with Libra and their person? For Libra's person, please. What's their energy towards Libra? Wow. Surrender. So this person been working overtime to guard their heart, to guard their feelings, guard their emotions. But why do I feel like there's a breakthrough coming where this person isn't going to be able to hold back like they've been doing? Okay. What's going on with Libra? Libra, you're on your spiritual path, right? I wonder if this person is meant to be on your spiritual journey with you at this point in your journey. It seems like you may have taken the time out with that bike being over there to um to stop and reflect on this spiritual journey, but I feel like you're being advised to keep going forward. The doors are currently open for you. You know, if this, if your person's a masculine, you know, masculine energies have to surrender to love because they be feeling like they be giving up other stuff when they surrender, right? So, and then this person is still holding on to something, something they're keeping close to their chest. They're still holding back something, but I feel like... Whatever they've been holding on to have become heavy. You know how they say, what is it? If you hold your hand up in the air, the first minute is okay. The second minute, the third, you know. But after a while, it starts getting heavier and heavier and heavier to the point where you just got to, like, let it down. That's kind of like what this person energy is. Like, whatever they've been holding on to is became so heavy that it's time for them to release it. Okay. Beloved, what's going on with Libra's person? What does Libra person want Libra to know, please? What does Libra person want Libra to know? I've been done wrong over and over again. And every time I give my heart to someone, they take me for granted. I don't want to be hurt no more. So I hold back. I hold back what I feel inside because I'm afraid. To be taken advantage of. People claim that they loved me. That they cared about me. And they betrayed my trust. The way I feel. I don't feel like feeling that emotion again. It was so hard for me to move forward. From that hurt and from that pain. I, I taunted a lot of people. I sabotaged a lot of connections. Because I didn't want to be hurt no more. You know that feeling that I felt. It was rough. I couldn't get past it for a long time. I couldn't get past the fact of how I love somebody so much and how they could hurt me. So when I met you, Libra, when I met you, like you reopened that wound for me because I started feeling for you. I started feeling something instantly for you. And I didn't want to feel that. It made me run away. It made me try to disconnect from you. It made me act cold and harsh and cruel. I never meant to hurt you. But I was hurting myself by trying to hurt you. I hope that one day you can forgive me for all the things that I put you through. I just couldn't let you get close to me. Getting close to me means I got to open my heart up. I got to let you in. I didn't want to let nobody in after what I experienced. It was too painful, too hurtful. I don't want to go through that again. 
Wow. Let's go ahead and get into it. Love it. What's going on with Libra's person, please? Seven of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles. Page of Cups. <laughs> Temperance. The Four of Swords. The Five of Pentacles. One more, please. Wow. Ten of Wands. At the bottom of that, the Two of Pentacles. That's them trying to figure it out, Libra. Figure out, like, if you worth that risk. That risk of being hurt again, of being betrayed again, of being let go again, and feeling disappointed again. I feel like this person was disappointed in some connection. Disappointed by people around them because they definitely got on this, this armor, right? They definitely on their guard, right? See, sometimes we think it's all about us. Not realizing that people had traumas before they ever met us. We might just get the, the blunt force trauma from them, right? Like after they've been abused. They turn into the abuser, right? Isn't that how it works, even in psychology? The abused become the abuser in some instances. What's up with Libra? What's up with Libra, please? One more, please. At the bottom of your deck, the Page of Swords. Libra, you want more information from this person. You're not willing just to, like, let them off the hook that easy. You have your questions that you've been pondering in your mind. You kind of want to know why they behaved and acted the way they acted and whatnot. Wow. So you got the Ten of Cups, the Two of Wands, the Hangman, the Hierophant, Judgment, the Three of Swords. They got the Seven of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, Page of Cups, Temperance, Four of Swords, Five of Pentacles, and the Ten of Wands. Yeah. It's like you want to know more information. I don't think you cool with the way it left off. It's like, you know, you just left me puzzled with so many questions left unanswered. Like, I just want to know, you know, why you kind of behaved the way you did when I loved you so much. When things could have been so good between you and I. Like, I realized, like, I wasn't perfect. But I didn't deserve the way you treated me. You know, you're still trying to figure out, Libra. What happened within this connection? Because it still hurts you. You still like want this person. You still want to be in a relationship with this person. But you just feel like there were so many things left unsaid. Right? So many reasons why that you don't know. And I feel like that's what stopped you. Dead in your tracks on your spiritual journey. As you pondering and trying to figure out the answers to your questions. Right? Trying to figure out... Like, why suddenly did this storm come in this connection, right? Why suddenly this person switched up and went away? And I feel like at the beginning of this reading, it gave you a lot of answers to why this person suddenly switched up and uh, went away. You know, your person, that betrayal or whatever they dealt with, I mean, they didn't know what to do with that energy. You know, imagine you mean your person. This this is how they are in the spirit. Hey, Libra, how you doing? Right? The last thing that this person is thinking about is jumping right back into that same situation they just left. You know, falling in love again, being with, with someone and all of that type of stuff. Like, you know, I feel like this person was in avoidance energy because this shit really threw them off. 
but they were still huh, healing from what they went through healing from the the pain of loss and all the energy and stuff they put into it for some of them somebody popped up with a baby on them or something or the baby wasn't theirs or something like that like this betrayal really hurt this person this person has spent many nights and days thinking about how that it hurt them right you know it's not like they don't see like you wifey material or husband material right because they definitely do it's just they really would have to make a conscious decision to take another chance, take another risk. And I'm not sure whether or not, Libra, this person is ready to do that right now, right? Like, this could be the reason for so many things left unsaid, you know? When people realize that masculine and feminine energies that we're more alike than we think, but we just deal with things totally different, right? Beloved, so I'm going to use my um, DMHP Table Etiquette Love Oracles. And uh, see how this person's feeling about you. See how you're feeling about this person, Libra. Beloved, what's going on with Libra and their person? How does Libra person feel about Libra, please? Wow. I ran past your house. I watch you on social media. And I secretly stalk you. That's a lot of energy to um, put forth for something that you act like you don't want. So this person definitely wants you. Definitely worries about what you're doing when they're not around. Definitely wonders if you are loyal, if what you really say is real, if you really love them. Right? They feel like if they see you with somebody else or they see another man or another woman coming out your house then they was justified in their actions and doing what they did. They feel like if they could just catch you in some bullshit, then they're justified. It's almost that moment of like, I knew it. I knew it was too good to be true. I just knew it. I wish your family would stay out of our business. So for some of you Libras out there, you get, and, and I know this is a Libra's message. Because Libras are all about family and friendships, right? Relationships, right? Some of you Libras, they don't like the fact that, you know, your family is all involved in the situation with you and them. It's like, um, it's like, you know, how you want to just be with a person. And there's always somebody at their house or there's always somebody at the door or there's always somebody else involved or people have um, a say in the relationship that they shouldn't have a stay, say in and all that. It's like, I just wish your family would stay the hell out of our fucking business, Libra. You could be dealing with the Scorpio or the Scorpio energy is prominent in your reading. Um, maybe your person's a Scorpio or maybe this is that death energy of that um a ending or something maybe the family member they want to stay out of your business is a Scorpio could be a few for that one okay look who's at the bottom of the deck Libra what's behind it Ooh. karmic partner and they give me money I'm not going into that story Libra. that's a whole nother story you guys can take that how that applies how's Libra feeling about um their person you could be dealing with the Taurus or this could be that hair fin energy can I get one more please and a thank you wow you feel like this person don't love you no more Libra yeah they do all this riding past your house, watch you on social media, all this. Remember, this person had to turn cold, had to act a certain way because of what they experienced in their previous relationships. Remember, this is someone that has to surrender to love. This isn't someone who just easily gives it away. Could also be a Leo energy Libra. Okay. 
Let's see. I want to get a couple more for how this person feels about you. I'm going to use my Twin Flames Preparing for Union deck. Not because this is a Twin Flame relationship. It could be. But just because I want to see their heart energy, right? What's really in their heart for you. Beloved, how does this person feel about Libra, please? How does this person feel about Libra? They're definitely, Libra, not done with you, right? Like, if, if you knew what they told you at the beginning of this read, Libra, I think that would make a profound difference. The people aren't that transparent to um tell you those type of things. Wow, this is going to blow you away. Facts. This is why they ran past your house watching you on social media and stalking you. You know, maybe they thought they could just move on and not feel nothing, which is what they actually want to do. I'm going to be honest with you. They actually just wanted to move on and not feel anything and feel any emotions and feel any pain. But they feel like here I am again in love. So I feel like your person is a lover, Libra, underneath the surface of everything. But they just had it rough before you. I don't know what happened. At the bottom of the deck, I dream of you. So they dream of Jenny. They dream of Libra. Okay. Ooh. Yeah. They think like you a diamond in the rough, Libra. But they want to give you one. So like I said, they see you as wifey material, Libra. Just. They just been hurt before. Okay. So let's see. Do I want to get any other messages for Libra? Nope, I think I'm going to leave it right there. Okay, so you guys, I thank you so much for tapping into Black Madonna HP's Table Etiquettes. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to check out BlackMadonnaHP.com. And until next time, love, peace, and so take care.